Now, Rich was talking about these strong winds and how it helped create some snow rollers. And viewers, they have been using our reported feature on WKBN.com to send photos like this one into our newsroom. It kind of shows the formations there. And we sent WKBN's Jeff Lev Coolidge out to get a first-hand look. And he joins us live now from Trumbull County. Jeff, what are you seeing? Well, good afternoon, Damon. People across Cortland and other parts of northern Trumbull County woke up to these this morning. They're called snow rollers. They come in different sizes. Take a look at this one. It's about two feet across, and uh, it's about five pounds. Now, there's a couple things that are needed for these snow rollers, which are a rare phenomenon to occur. Take a look at some of the video as I talk to you and give you a couple points about it that we shot this morning over in Johnson. Now, these snow rollers, apparently there's several conditions needed. One of those is a strong blowing wind, and that's what they had here in the area last night. And also, the temperature uh, sank uh, to around the melting point last night uh, for a brief time. And uh, we also had those conditions as well. And that allowed the snow to sort of roll the, the icy mixture together and keep it going for a long time to form uh, these snow rollers right here. People around here tell me they have never seen anything like it. The lady who lives behind me, she told me that she actually just saw a special on TV, a special report from like the Weather Channel talking about uh, these snow rollers. But coming up tonight at 6, we'll have more uh, on this uh, rare phenomenon that people I woke up to this morning. There's thousands of them all over the yards around here, and we'll have more on that coming up. But for now, reporting live from Cortland, I'm Trumbull County Bureau Chief Jeff Left Coolidge for WKBN 27 First News. So David, cool video you. there, and Jeff's looking pretty cool there too with your shades on, showing how bright it is out there. Thank you very much, Jeff.